Hello. Today I'm going to show a more advanced tutorial on Outlook for Microsoft O365. First, I'm going to sign into my account on login.microsoftonline.com. I'll approve the sign in request. And I'm going to click the Outlook out app here in the top left. This is going to be important if you have shared mailboxes. You may want to check that shared mailbox or send from that shared mailbox online. To do that, go over here to the top right. You see Kenneth Jackson. Open another mailbox. I'm going to go to our monitoring email, monitor at simplifymyit.us. I'm going to open it. Now I'm under this email. If I were to send a message from this email address, I'm going to send it to myself. I'm going to call it test. Did everyone check what you sent or if you sent something? You check in the sent items. See, I got a notification over here. Test. This is my main account. You can see it was sent from monitor instead of my Kenneth Jackson. Speaking of the Outlook out, you can see the one installed on my computer has a new message icon. This one, you can make rules. Let's create a rule. Go to the top, click rules, create rule. Let me go to advanced options, moving from one account to a folder. Anything from monitor. If you click this, you can change it to any email you want. I want to keep it on monitor. Next, I'm going to move it to a specified folder. Now, these are all my folders in my inbox. I'm going to make a new one. I'm going to call it monitor test. As you can see, populated under monitor, which I've already made. I'm going to click OK. It's going to move anything from monitor to monitor test folder. Next, you can do exceptions. Next, turn on this rule. Usually I run this rule now on messages already in the inbox. You saw that the monitor email disappeared. If you go to monitor test, you're going to see the email. That's how you create a rule. Also, if you want to know how to make an email on the application on your computer, you just click New Email. Pops up a new email. Now you have the From button. So if I wanted to send from another email address, click other email address, type it in, I don't know if you noticed before, but it was already populated since I've done this once before. You could also just click it once you've done it once before. I'm going to send it to myself again. and send it. 